Okay, we've made it inside this very old house. I just showed you guys the old doorknob here on the door. Or sorry, not the doorknob, the doorbell. That is old. It's a very old house. Uh, I'm not quite sure how old. I'm gonna do some research on it and see what I can find. But yeah, Carlo and I made it inside. We're in the kitchen right now. Check his all his stuff out in the description. I'm pumped for this house. It looks old. It looks historic. Looks right up my alley. So let's get at it. So, Dude, what the hell is this? Whoa, 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 whoa. No way. Where's it? It's tied off, too. What the hell happened here? I don't know. That's a first I've ever encountered that. You ever come into an abandoned place and seen that before? No. Never? Never. What the hell? You think there's somebody upstairs? Yeah, same. Like, I'm looking at all the molding and everything. This is awesome, but... Yeah. Oh, nice. The staircase is beautiful. Look at it in the mirror. Oh yeah. Ask me and help. Yeah. Does she have uh, vents there? Oh yeah, the metal cool. vents. I like the clock up. Look at the yeah. toilet. Yeah. That's like 19... 24 or something? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what that style of toilet's from, but that's... I've never seen a toilet like that in a house. Oh, shit. It doesn't even have a back part. Yeah, it's just like the toilet, and then it's a <laughs> pipe going into the... That's connected to the wall. Oh, 
Oh my god, I just noticed a fuzzy thing on the top. <laughs> of all the things to look at, the piping, I look at the fuzzy thing on the toilet. Oh, this floor is covered with more old newspapers. Ooh, there's a hole here, so be careful if you come in here. Like it's 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 a vent. This is not safe because people could have put the paper here on purpose for us to fall through, but I don't know. 1945. This newspaper. 1946. I found some comic strips. Nice. Oh, it's the first piece of furniture other than that chair in the kitchen. Doesn't look very old. What is that thing? Oh, you know what this is? I've only seen a couple of these before. This is an old uh, bed frame. I've only seen these once or twice before. It's a wire mesh bed frame. Oh yeah, the decay in here is amazing. It seems like this was locked multiple times, and it looks like this was off multiple times. With all the different holes. It was locked on the outside. Yeah. So it was locking people into the room. That's crazy shit. No word of a lie. Why would you trap someone in here? Like, I don't know what the hell we walked into, to be honest, but... <laughs> Uh, yeah, dead animals, nooses, rooms that people have been locked into. Quite the find. Yeah, this has been on our bucket list too for a long time. And it was just a chance that it was open. Guys, when you do urban exploring, you always check spots that you don't have on your list. And make sure you conquer them before you, before you say, okay, I'm done with it. There's plastic on those windows? Yeah. Why would that be? They wouldn't be weatherproofing and it's boarded. No. That's that's something else. Like what would they what would they use that for? To keep the smell in? Maybe. But then why aren't the rest of them? Why would they only do that on one? I can tell you though, some of the wood uh, shelving in here is gorgeous. Is this furniture? Uh, here, look at this. Yes, it is. A natural decay right here on the wall. This is uh, a photographer's dream oh, right here. Oh, beauty. I like this, how it's all just... Oh yeah, the door frame? Yeah, natural decay cracking. And I don't know what the hell this kind of wallpaper is. <laughs> it's like a, a bad 1960s wallpaper or something. Yeah. Dude, there's another floor. There's three floors. There's another floor? Yeah. No way. What kind of craziness are we going to find up here? Dude, these are soft. The stairs are soft? Yeah. Okay. They're very soft. 
This is a dream find for explorers, holy. Other than the noose and the dead animals and... <laughs> the old vent. The remains of some old tiles. Yeah, what the hell did they just... Yo, yo, yo. What? I don't think so. I could have just been on the road. Oh. You can hear them? Yeah. There's no window here. I haven't heard people, I heard car doors. So we're gonna keep our voices down, that's for sure. There's another car door. Look at this, more shelving. Hmm? No. That's no raccoon. Look at the teeth on it. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that is. This place is kind of freaking me out. What the hell is that? Yeah, I'm with you, man. I'm getting jumpy in here. There's a room here. Be careful if you like. Okay. People what do you think they did here? Look at how much shelving they have everywhere. More old school tile. I have to be careful, there is an open window there. Which I'm going to peek out. Okay, we're all right. Heading downstairs to see if there's a basement. Um, what happened in this place is really, really kind of weird, stupid, and freaky. I'm going to show you guys something. Are you ready for this? Oh, hang on. Oh, you're coming down? down? Yeah. Wait till you see what I found, guys. What's this? Okay, this house could be a lot older than I thought. Look at the old stone foundation. I think we're looking at 1800s here for the age on this house. Yeah, this old stone foundation is giving that away. Not a whole lot to see down in the basement other than the old stonework, 
which is amazing in itself. Flat walls. Wow. I might as well go up. See what Carlos is saying and seeing if we can find anything else in here. All right, we are outside of probably one of the, if not the, most creepy abandoned house I've ever been in. How about you? Yeah. Yeah, it ranks up there, that's for sure. I've never found uh, a noose hanging from uh, the banister of a stairway before, which definitely gave me the heebie-jeebies. Dead animals, claw marks in the walls, all the rest of it. But this is also a very old historic house. The architecture is beautiful, but it's creepy. Such an awesome explorer. Uh, Carlo and I have had this on our bucket list. It was a pure chance that we came by it and found it open. Uh, I'm so glad we did. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, how creepy was this to you guys? Uh, what did you think of the architecture? And all the rest of it. Uh, Carlo has gone somewhere, so hit him up. All his info is gonna be in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And see you on the next adventure.